Okay, rolling in the spirit of the party, the Sangre Negra party, and um, Elise's birthday party, I have two cast members from the film, the TV show Sangre Negra. And what is your name and what is your role on the film? Uh, my name is Jennifer Field, and I play news reporter Susan Wu. You play news reporter, so I'm pretty, pretty much playing your role right, right here in real life. Yes, yeah. that's right. Does that make you jealous? Um, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit. I'm taking cues. I'm, okay, take, taking, I'm cues. taking cues. Okay. Cues and clues <laughs> right now. I'm glad to see that I have effect in your next role, uh, next scene that you're going to yes. shoot on this wonderful TV show. So, um, um, to be on a, on a more serious note, how did you get cast for this uh, role? Well, for me, I did go uh, the traditional route, and uh, my wonderful agent at the time, uh, Chris Lee, got me in an audition, um, and I was able to meet Frank and Antonio in the audition, and lo and behold, I got a call back, and, um, and I booked the role. And it was funny because I've noticed that um, I've was sort of on a roll at the time of playing news reporters or journalists. So I'm at, this is actually about the third news reporter or journalist role that I've been working in. No way, really? So I guess I should have your job. <laughs> <laughs> wow, wow, wow. So she's good at it too. You're good at it. Okay, okay, good. So, um, so far, you've shot, shot a couple um, episodes. Correct. And um, so, you, does your character evolve uh, with each episode? And um, just give us a little dirt. Uh, what's you know what's going on? Great question. Um, I noticed that as as the season evolves, that she gets a little bit closer to uh, the saga involved with Ricky Santos, and really, he is the key to all the answers. And I have this natural kinship this natural chemistry. It's partly written in and partly what I've just created. And I feel like that if I can get to him, he can confide in me about what's going on. And I'm a woman. Women use what they got to use, you know? And I'm not saying I'm doing anything, you know. So you're going to flirt to get your you way? Know, you know, I, I feel like it's going to continue going in that route. And I see Susan Wu, seriously, I feel like that she is going to have, there's going to be a night where I get him alone with me and him. Mm. This is my prediction. This is not written yet. But I could see that happening. And I just really get everything that I need to get so I can get my story. I can get my promotion. With the power of the booty. Well... Let's let's say Susie, you know, doesn't necessarily have to go all the way, but you never know. Well, that's that's always been the downfall of men in the in the history of uh, of of life. Yes, and I know that very that's well. A lot of power to have in a female, <laughs> <laughs> and you use it well. Huh? <laughs> I use it. I don't abuse it. Let's just say. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm a I'm a good um. I try to work with you know from an ethical standpoint. At all times. Okay. Ethical. I don't know how Even ethical in, that is. In my is. own life as well as in Susie's life. <laughs> all right, Ike. Is Ike your real name or your character's name? My, Tell my us a little. My character's name is Isaiah uh, Ike. Oh, okay, uh, nice. My real name is Billy Smith, and I play Ricky's right hand man and best friend. So I'm the guy that watches out for him. So if you got to get to Ricky, you got to get through me first, and I'm not hard to, I'm not easy to get through. So I, I got short temper, I don't trust anybody. And I'm looking out for her and anybody else that's trying to do what Ricky and Ike are trying to set up. Hold on, hold on. Let me, uh, I'm missing something. How are you looking out for her? Because, well, see, she's trying to find out what our story is, what's going on with, with Ricky Santos, the whole Santos family. Uh, what Are we good guys? Are we bad guys? Who are we? Oh, so, so she's suspect to you. Yeah. Yeah, so it's like, you know, I got my eye on her, you know, I'm, I'm watching for her, and we, f we find out how close she actually gets to Ricky, you know, how does she woo her way into our inner circle, you know, things like that. So I'm, I'm, the, I'm the man that, that keeps the house in order. I see, I see, I get it now. So how did you get this role, this part, uh, was it given to you? Did you have to audition, you know, go through the Hollywood dance well, to get there? Well, I, I ran into Tony, who plays Ricky Santos, threw him on the ground, put a gun to his head, and was like, this is mine, I'm taking it. 
So you can say no, but the answer is still going to be yes. You know, I, I go back years with, with, with Tony and with Frank, uh, the producers, and um, basically it's like, I got something for you. Um, and it's like, it's perfect for you because it's, it's pretty much who you are. So um, come in, let's do a couple of things and let's make it happen. And, and that's how I got involved because the relationship. And that's, you know, Hollywood is all about your relationships. You know, you, you meet people, you stay on good terms, you stay on great terms. And the work should speak for itself. And that's pretty much where, where we started and where we are today. The work spoke, spoke for itself and, and we continued our relationships. Okay, I see. So how long have you been grinding in, in Hollywood? Hollywood, Hollywood, Hollywood. Um, let's see. I moved here in '91. What? Say, 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 say that again. 1991. <laughs> wow. Yeah, but I, I've I've done some of everything. You know, I've, I was involved in music for a little while. I was involved in dance for a little while. Um, and then next thing you know, acting came along. I've been in, involved in the stunt world. Um, so it's pretty much whatever was happening that I could be expressive as an entertainer. Uh, I stuck my fingers in there, and some things worked really well, some things worked better. And, you know, as an, as an artist, you want to be able to exploit everything you can from a creative perspective. So if it's happening, it's happening. And I'm always ready to adapt and move into other things as, as it necessitates itself. So, yeah. Well, that is so true. You know what they say about overnight success in Hollywood? Ten to fifteen years in Hollywood, yeah. then people see you and they're like, "That guy's an overnight success." But you've been grinding, yeah, you, grind, you, grind, you know. Grind That's point. amazing, because you know what you're saying about how you met uh, Ricky, which is Tony, right? Mm -hmm. Had it, not, have you not been in this town for those years grinding? It's not gonna happen. It looks so easy. Yeah. It sounds yeah. easy, but it's not easy. No, it's not at all. So that is the work that paid off, and you have put in the work, my friend. Yes, that is good. Yes. That is good. So one, any last words before you guys go enjoy the rest of the party because I can hear the good music blasting back there. I, know, right? I love this song, by the way. Um, I just want to say I am so happy that, that you were here tonight and that we were able to get together as a family or as a familia, familia. Uh, you know, and um, I'm, I'm so proud to be a part of Sangre Negra and I, I, I only hope the best and I expect the best, actually. Yeah, we, we've got a great cast. We've got great chemistry within the cast. I mean, everybody, when, from day one, it, it felt like a family. Everybody was really close, especially this one right here. Um, so I just say... My audition. <laughs> we were in a rehearsal. Well, hold on. I, I'm feeling some kind of... There seemed to be some kind of chemistry here, <laughs> down, aside from the filming. From Is there Bill, anything Bill, going on? You want to spill the beans? No, there's no beans to spill. <laughs> Billy's been down since day one. Okay. That's all I have but, to but say. But that's that's an example of how yeah. how quick the cast gelled. So he's all professional. Yeah, yeah. It, ah. it, it, it felt like family from day one, you yeah. know. Um, but yeah, just just tune in, watch because there's gonna be lefts, rights, uppercuts. There's gonna be stuff hitting you from every angle we can throw at you. So you never know what you're gonna get when you open that door. So just ju jump in, tune in, and stay tuned in. Well, wow, I'm I'm really excited for this show. I'm I'm looking um, for I'm hoping for big things to happen with this show. Okay, before you guys go, can we uh, give a big shout out to Elise? I know today is her birthday. Yes. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. <laughs> and many more, Mama.